Cool. <laughs> Thankfully, going forward, there's not going to be multiple skin types. We can just take it one at a time. So, at what point do you want to do the Heracles this, like, jack match? Because I'm almost done with it. And here's the thing. From what I've found, you can scale them in three different places. Which one, which, which one did you think was the best? I'm going to be honest here. This one's kind of like, I don't really think the color changed much on any of these. No, but I, I think the white kind of looked a little bit better. It, it matches the button better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll just, be, I'll just be very quick on this one. I think it's a, I think it's like a seven out of ten. There's nothing really, there's nothing really particularly good about it, but it's not like offensively bad or anything. Yeah, it's kind of bland. Which is kind of ironic because we have apparently a hoodie up next. Oh, oh, it's a, oh, it's a Neko hoodie, and she's not wearing any pants either, from what it looks like. Okay, yeah. Hang on, I'm still waiting for that to, to come to me. Oh yeah, that's okay. So, and I guess with the tag servant cat on it. Oh. oh. Me wow. <laughs> okay, so this is very clearly meant to be just the hoodie and a collar. Very hot topic. <laughs> You're not wrong. She's all she's missing is the eyeliner, and we've got like a straight up hot topic employee. Um, I'm gonna say the black one looked the best, but ultimately I don't think it really matters. Again, I think this is just works out both ways. Yeah, I, the black's just more visually appealing. <laughs> uh, so first off, there's not really any clipping, which. I'm kind of surprised by it. I think there's a little... No, 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 I take it back. There's some clipping. Yep, there's some clipping right there in the hoodie with the hair. How embarrassing. <laughs> I can't not see clipping anymore. I hate you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry my eyes work, <laughs> Um, I, I want to say a 7 out of 10 again. It's not, like, really bad. The jacket texture looks nice. But it's, like... It's also nothing really super impressive or anything of the sort. Uh, I'd probably go with maybe 7.5 because it, it's not, the, the black looks like all right. Yeah, it looks like a good outfit. It's just nothing really like super crazy. Yeah. And speaking of super crazy, this is the deluxe costume. So this was the sexual outfit that every character got at the game. And, okay, so... I mean, it looks good. But it's basically... So they basically just took the schoolgirl concept <laughs> and removed the clothing. No, no, never mind. This is this is Hot Topic. <laughs> this, this is what you'd see in Hot Topic? Tell me I'm wrong. I don't think any of the girls who go to Hot Topic would be bold enough to wear so little, uh, would be bold enough to show that much skin inherently. Mm, must be a country thing. It, it, I'm pretty sure it is. Sounds like your Hot Topic's better than my Hot Topic. <laughs> in certain aspects, my country is better than yours in, in some. <laughs> Seems so, and they all seem to be the type that would revolve around concepts that would be associated with that are alive. Who could have guessed? <laughs> Um, I'll be honest, I, I actually kind of like it for the most part. Like, it, it's got a, a decent fucking skirt. The outfit looks nice for the most part, nice and simple. Um, it's not as weird. I think it's because it's the deluxe costume than the other one. Again, her first outfit looks very, very weird to me. So, I'm going to guess one, I think like a 8 or 9 out of 10. I, I think it's a pretty solid outfit. Yeah, I can, I can see an 8. Oh, the gloves also have, I guess, a little layer of texture to them, so that's nice. And now we have the wedding costume. Every girl... Oh. Um. It's all right. But it's just kind of fucking... It's just kind of weird. So it's just to let everyone know, like, the reason why I don't talk for, like, a solid minute is because I'm waiting for my stream to catch up. Yeah, for some fucking reason, uh, I don't know if it's because of where he's at in the world, or if it's because, like, my internet provider, 
But he's like a little delayed when it comes to the skins themselves and shit. Mm. I think, I think all yeah, the- I can see what you mean. She she doesn't look like a bride, but more like one of the fucking bridesmaids' daughters who holds the flowers. Yeah, I was gonna say she looks like the fucking flower girl going down the aisle first. So that's where it's like. I mean, the skin line itself's not bad, but it's just kind of weird seeing her in it. I mean, it's not a bad outfit, but I, I think it's the side tassel things. She she has too many side tassel things or things like that go around her arms. I don't understand why. Um, mm. I, I'm going to say 6 out of 10 because it's a little weak overall. Yeah, I'm probably going to go for 5. All right, moving on to the Pirates of the Seven Seas costume. And while I'm waiting for, <laughs> you know, uh, I, I, oh, that's kind of weird. Oh, she blinks way too much. I think this might be so far on the channel, the, probably the best pirate skin we've had so far. It's definitely the best cosplay. It's no longer a one, a one piece one. <laughs> this looks somewhat accurate. <laughs> Uh, and, and for once, the hat doesn't look fucking weird. I, I think, like, personally, I think if they lost the fucking blue feathers in the hat, it would look way better. <laughs> you don't like accentuating the color scheme? No, it's just... You, you, you know... Tell me I'm wrong. You, you don't see fucking... Neon blue fucking feathers in pirate hats. You, you don't? But it's... Okay, so technically there are birds of a neon feather in, like, the areas of, I think, Southern America. And pirates were there, so, I mean, I guess you could argue she's just a Southern American pirate. <laughs> so, so besides the fucking neon feathers, uh, I think the rest of the outfit actually looks pretty good. Yeah, I mean, if you discount that, it's a solid, like, 8.5. Yeah. Uh, that's probably going to be the best pirate skin we're going to see in the entirety of this fucking, uh, of this entire this series. I don't think we're going to see any better pirate skins beyond that one. Uh, moving on, we have the... Wow, this costume straight up fucking sucks. <laughs> this is... This is awful. <laughs> Oh, no, I don't like that. Well, it's it's straight up her default outfit with just two more pieces attached to it. Exactly. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to give this one a fucking... This is a four. I'm not even going to waste that much time on it. This is a four. What do you think? Fucking two and a half. <laughs> oh, okay. So now we get to her bikini outfit. Uh, yeah, that's, that's to be expected. Um, just so people know, she is 19. They are all legal, uh, by the events that are alive six. <laughs> that is completely true. 19 doesn't have the fucking body of one, though. The jeans were not kind to her, Kyle. So while we for Kyle to, uh... Oh, I can see it. Alright, so what are, what are you thinking? Mm, not much of an impact. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, well, I guess not really unfortunately, but uh, we, we were just talking to Neo a few minutes ago. I'm going to give it like a fucking, I'm going to give it like a 5 out of 10. It's not offensively bad, but it's like not really good either. 5 is solid, but the the thing that shits me about this costume straight up is like, they've, they've got the white, but then the crotch is just fucking black, so it draws the eye straight away. <laughs> I, so I have I have my I have my mic in front of the crotch area for some reason. That's that's where like it appears. So I don't even notice it too much. But when I'm looking uh, at the video for the and, stream, and you tell me you don't like traps. <laughs> when I'm looking at the actual screen for the video, I can see what you're talking about. Yeah, I, I get what you're saying. Yeah, I, I'll just give it a five out of ten. I'll just start loading the next game while you give your verdict. <laughs> I already gave it like five. Uh, next one is the Summer Breeze. This is the one that I think for the last couple of girls were like, 
if they were like a fucking farmer. Uh, it's not the Disney princess one. It's fucking <laughs> Belle from Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> That's what you're gonna take this one as? Straight, straight. Dude, have Disney you seen it? Beauty and the Beast? I, I have, I have. Tell me I'm wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> All she needs is for the like the white yellow to be a little more gold, and this would be straight up like almost one for one for the outfit. Oh, can we get somebody? Good. Can we get somebody to mod a hairy rig so they can have the dance scene? <laughs> that would be amazing. Um, regarding this one though, um, again, not really too much to really say here. Uh, I think it's probably one of the better Summer Breeze skins in general because she just fits it better. So I'm just. Gonna I mean. It's kind of weird how all the summer, how all the summer breeze ones are all just like what you would assume country girls wear. <laughs> She's missing the straw hat. That's the problem. <laughs> Easy ten out of ten with the straw hat. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna give it an eight out of ten. It's it, it's it's fine. The texture's nice. The color palette's nice. Um, but there's not really anything really nice about it inherently. Mm, I'll probably give it a seven. Morphine Ninja costume. I'll be honest, this is probably gonna be our best skin if we're. Well, uh, no, I haven't seen the rest, but it's it's actually pretty good. Wait, the bubble's not even connected there back. Uh, it's floating there, just in midair. That's, oof. And it clips into the scarf super <laughs> far. <laughs> oh, that's. Never mind. I take it back. Oh, that's so noticeable now. <laughs> it clips and it fucking floats everywhere. Oh my god, what is this? Uh, the kunai do have a nice shine to them, but there's not really a lot of other pieces on this outfit that really, that really make anything stand out. If I if I could get past the bow, well, no, because it's also clipping into the actual scarf on the actual main outfit too. Oh, this is this is awful. What even I mean, I'm not really feeling it. It's it's clipping literally everywhere. I think this is the skin that's clipped the most. What is this? I'm gonna give it. I, I was gonna give it a. I was gonna give it like a seven out of ten at first, but no, I'm gonna give this like a three out of ten. I'm, this wasn't even a good effort. <laughs> the bow's fucking floating in midair for God's sakes. Look, I'd give it a three if the bow was at least connected to the back. <laughs> Two, because this is fucking lazy. All right. Uh, Revival Sexy Bunny. I don't think she can pull it off. And, um... Actually, it's a nice color of blue. The actual leather looks fine. The gold's shiny. Um... It's actually not a bad of an outfit. The gloves look nice too, actually. <laughs> I tried fixing my latency. For some reason, the latency just doesn't fucking increase. Or I can't really fix it. And there's, what well, it looks like there's almost next to no clipping this time. Wow, didn't think I'd have to worry about clipping. Any clipping anywhere? Nope, good to go. Are you still there, Kyle? Hmm, here, let me pause this real fast. I actually think it looks nice. Uh, I was expecting it to fail, but I think it worked out actually overall pretty well. Yeah. Actually, I could see her, like, working at a casino wearing this. Yeah, this is definitely something you would see, like, fucking uh, a bartender, not a bartender, but, like, a waitress wearing, I guess, in a casino fucking foreign shit. I could easily see that working out. Mm. Uh, I, I, I'm going to say this. I think this might actually be her best skin so far. Yeah, the, it it's not too crazy, but yeah, it looks really good. I'm gonna give this one a nine out of ten. I I don't think it's ten out of ten material, but I I, I think it's an easy solid nine. I'd give it probably about maybe eight and a half. All right. Which party costume? Um, another an actual another solid cosplay here, but she gets a fucking. She gets a giant ass staff in the back. I don't think the other girls got that, and it's not connected to her back. Oh my god. 
Damn it. And the glow. So, uh, so, so I've never done 3D animation, but surely it can't be that hard to fucking have items stick to the character. I think it might be, because I think... No, it's not even touching the hair either. I think they do this for gameplay purposes, but honestly, the rest of the costume does look really good. I mean, no, I've still yet to get to it. Don't worry, I'll wait. <laughs> but no, yeah, no, the staff, the staff just doesn't connect. Does, does the belt connect? The belt of flowers? The belt of flowers does connect. Alright, that's, 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 that's good at least. Yeah, still not yet. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Hang on, let me just pause it then. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's super fucking anime. But it, it's got, like, nice texture and everything behind it. Like, the, the costume looks great. And even the staff looks good if it just wasn't fucking floating like that. Mm. And let's be honest, like, out of the entire roster of Terra Live, she's absolutely the one who watches anime. <laughs> uh, her, her and Hanukkah are, like, her and Hanukkah are, like, because Hanukkah's the actual schoolgirl, ironically enough. They're, they're for sure the ones who watch anime. The gloves look nice. Uh, honestly, if it, if the staff was just on the character's back and shit, I think this would be a solid 10 out of 10. Yeah, as it sits, I'm probably going to say fucking maybe an 8. Yeah, I don't have to give it an 8. That staff is just not uh That staff just doesn't sell. Wait, It's kind of sad it? as well that like all the aesthetical items can't be used in actual combat in the game. Yeah, I'm surprised weapon combat never became a thing in Dead or Alive to some extent. Because you know, Rewind Boost has got a giant ass katana on his back and he can, he can never fucking use it. Uh, so I guess we have a, another bikini outfit? I thought we already got. No, okay, so no. Last one was Seaside Eden. This one, yeah, okay, that's fine. Gotta wait for the gotta wait for the eternal sunrise that is Kyle to get to the video clip. It's getting there. <laughs> I don't know if it's your connection or if it's just the service itself. That's kind of the part that bugs me is I can't figure out what the actual problem is. Well, it does have to fly halfway around the world. Does that actually fucking make a difference? Like, if you're watching a stream from like, like on Twitch, do you actually are you actually that straight up minute delayed? I'm not quite sure. I mean, you'd think it'd fly as fast as like, like um, my voice chat. That's exactly the point. Like, uh, you would think it's faster. Dude. You can see it now. Yeah. Um, not sure what to make of it. Oh, are you guys doing the new video? Yeah. Uh, I'll be honest. I'm just gonna give it a fucking. I'm just gonna give that uh that bikini one like a five out of ten. It's not offensively bad or anything, but it's also kind of like boring as fuck. It's super boring, but I think what really strikes me is the fact that it looks like she's just cut a fucking tea towel uh, into. Like, it doesn't look like a dead or alive skin, and then the uh the buttons undone. Ah. There it is. <laughs> no, uh, I'm just, I just go to the skin earlier now, so that way Kyle can show up at a more recent time frame. <laughs> there was a, there was a, it's the meme of a sauce. Uh, I mean, it, it kind of relates to this, but it's kind of uh, I'm going to get a five out of ten by the way for the bikini. It's not very interesting. There's a, there was a meme for a sauce where it's like, she's my girlfriend, but it zooms into the girl's bikini and you can see a bulge. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've seen that one actually. <laughs> so it's like, ooh. Interesting take there. Uh, did you already get to the next skin or no? I still haven't gotten to it. Okay. I'm going to start starting on the next one then. Um, so what, what's your ultimate thoughts on the bikini one? Ah, super boring. Probably a four. All right. Man, this one's kind of boring as well. So this one was actually an anime crossover with the exercise anime. I don't know if you've seen it before. You know, where, like, Japan no. tried to get an anime set up to where they, like, they would exercise so they have hot girls doing exercises and shit in the anime? Right. So it was actually a crossover with Dead or Alive. That actual anime crossed over with them, and uh, all the girls who were out at the time got the gym outfit, basically. 
interesting. Uh, I'm going to give hers like a 6 out of 10 because it's better than the bikini by itself, but it's also like kind of boring overall. The textures on the actual shorts were nice though for the most part. Mm, probably a 5. Fair enough. And you should be loaded up to the next one in like another minute or so. Regarding the Santa Helper's outfit real fast, um, the bell looks good as it did in all the other skins. The outfit just looks fine, but just doesn't really look very good on her, so I'm just going to give it like a 5 out of 10. It's just not very good on her. Yeah, she doesn't really fill it out too well. Uh, I'm going to give the Santa Bikini one a, a 1 out of 10. Uh, I, I, I despise this skin line in general. It was just super fucking lazy and shit. I'll be outraged too when I get eventually get there. So I think in the future what I'm going to do uh, for these particular videos is I might just record. Well, mm. uh, I mean, we were talking about this with me. I like, like less is more. Like when it comes to oh. Oh. The more, like, the more clothes, like, the better it looks. Yeah, no, absolutely. The, uh, especially the Santa ones. The Santa ones were just fucking stupid. Especially when you have Santa's helper skin, which is a much better costume in general prior to. So, this one's actually interesting when you get to this one. Uh, I'll go ahead and pause the video for now so you can get to it, because I do want to tell you a little bit about the fact. Weird. What did you do with Zoom? And Zoom actually records the different audio files. Zoom? Yeah. That's how I make my, my the podcast. Oh, we'll see about that. Uh, so this is actually from a season pass that cost $79, and it was to celebrate 2020. How much? Uh, the season pass cost $79. This game would only be in the season pass, yeah. Oh, my ass, I'm paying that. <laughs> oh, you're saying you don't like the 2020 fucking glasses? Ugh, no. I despise them when people used to fucking wear them around New Year's. Poor spot. So I'm actually going to try and go a little faster with these ones, just to see if it'll load them up a little faster for you by going at a rapid rate. So the next one's going to pop up for you is the, oh, the gorgeous dress, by the way. I'm going to give it a 5 out of 10, because it's not bad, but it's also not very good either. It's just a wedding dress and a golden fucking tint. Yeah. Just let me know when you get to the next skin so I can uh, scroll over to it real fast. Oh, wow, okay, it's a real chunk made by this one. <laughs> I feel As like the world turns, yeah, so the my boredom. Hurry up, Twitch. <laughs> I was going to say, I feel like I'm, I'm doing this, but I feel like it might not work out as well as I'm thinking it's going to work out. Ah, uh, there we go. So oh. Thinking, yeah, for me, the Neon Cat one, I understand why it's there, but it just doesn't really work for her. She just doesn't fill out the outfit at all. She doesn't fill it out, but I, but I like the design. I'd probably give it a 6 or 7 out of 10. It's definitely one of the better neon outfits. What is this bakery fucking outfit? This is the maid costume, actually. So this is just her being a maid. Personally, I'm going to give it like a 4 out of 10. At what? An anime cafe? <laughs> I mean, she landed the job easily. I'd give the, I'd give the maid costume a Oh! Oh! No, the you... the Chinese ones always do look good. Oh, yeah. And this one gives some real strong Chun Li vibes, I think. That's what I was thinking too, especially with like the things that have the hammer. What the fuck is that? That's the Gust mashup costume. So I'm not a fan. <laughs> uh, the next one should be uh, Alteria Rise mashup costume. So that's another uh, crossover series, but this one actually does look better in my opinion. Yeah, it's actually pretty alright. Uh, next up, you're going to go to the Design Costume 2019. So that one was a costume designed by a fan. 
Uh, there are six of them in the game, and then the game got shut down. And, and and they made one of them where she's a skill girl. Oh yeah, she has a she has like she has ironically enough she has multiple schoolgirl skins. Ironically enough. So have you thought of what, which one of the men we're doing? Oh, uh, unfortunately, I don't think we'll have time to do one of the guys today because fucking uh, it's already fucking big biting a bit late here. So what I'm thinking I'm gonna do is this. I'm thinking I'm gonna record short videos on this, uh, on this fucking uh, app, or on a uh, fucking um, this one. I'll send you the short video to see if it works the way I think it will, and if it does. The next time what will happen is I'll just record all the skins and we'll review them. But you'll have the videos there loaded up ready to go so you can just go to each individual skin and look at it. <gasps> What's this? Professionalism? <laughs> nah, fuck off. This should have been fine. But like for some reason you're... Fu <laughs> this was not a problem with fucking uh, Mixer. Let's not fucking lie to ourselves here. Well, you mean the superior streaming platform? For Xbox, absolutely. fucking movie. Okay, so just to run over the numbers real fast, uh, so the sci-fi skin, what would be your uh, thoughts on that one? <sighs> I say the schoolgirl one. I'm fucking. Uh, I'm gonna scroll back up to the sci-fi one, but hang on, let me see if I can't just fucking like, uh, let me see if I can do something here about this. Uh, let me see. Can I? Can I just here? I think what I'm gonna try and do is this. To help out with the speed a little bit of this video. So, for the Dead or Alive, for Dead or Alive, have you thought of going through each of the games and doing like a story review? A story review? No, I have not. Hang on. Let me just get these pictures out here now. Because for some, for some fucking reason, I don't know why you were delayed to Kingdom Come. I just don't get it. Yo, what's up, ladies? Like, it got way worse after the phone call. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. I'm taking pictures of them all now. I'm not going to go through, like, all, hey. all their sides again. But, like, for the most part, their backside do well. Let's go. show off anything too crazy here. Oh, my dumbass. I can record Yo, a clip with Bandicam and just upload what's it with up? Bandicam later. Well, what is that, uh, jukebox? I, I don't even have to record a video with fucking, um, with the fucking this one right here. Here, let me pause the video real fast, actually. Still there. I I made sure of that one. Okay, so Yo, I guess I've been I guess let's just start. So just start from the bottom one up, uh, from the from the Dang, most recent one upwards. This man. So school girl outfit, uh, rating. Dang. Uh, I don't know. Maybe six point five. I'm not really into the whole school girl thing. Uh, I completely understand. It's it's a fine outfit My i'd say a seven out of ten is, uh, but it's not really to, uh, anything special honestly hard. most of her skins aren't even all that fucking impactful uh next one will be the one above the revival high society this man straight muted me i mean i'm starting to see a trope with her is that like all of her clothes are fucking bland and boring <laughs> uh, absolutely fucking mm, absolutely no chill there huh Dude, you've seen me talk about things. I, I Am I the kind of person who seems like they have chill? Well, fair enough. You're not wrong. Dang. Oh, wow. Did my, yeah, thing, did my thing actually freaking... Uh, I think my thing actually just freaking messed up. Yeah. That's funny. Shit. Okay, well, it should be recording the audio still, so let's just... Um, Let's just fit. Oh no, it's not. Okay, so I'm gonna have to stop there.